Jan Michael Vincent had it all, looks, fame, a promising career, but years of drinking and a serious accident almost took everything away. But now Vincent is on a comeback. Jan Michael shared his life story only with extras Phil Schumann. They are classic Hollywood publicity stills. The chiseled face, blonde hair, blue eyes, rippling muscles. Yes, in the 1970s, Jan Michael Vincent was ticketed for stardom. In the 1990s, quite a different story. After years of drinking, drugs, the face is aged, the voice fragile, the dream unfulfilled. I'd like to be normal. I just happen to have this, this problem with alcohol. Publicly, things look good. Feature films like Hooper, Big Wednesday, TV's Airwolf. Privately, the life was one of court appearances, tabloid headlines, a pot bust, drunk driving, violence, two failed marriages. The first produced a daughter. At 52, he explains it this way. I've always had a wild streak. I'm kind of headstrong and do what I, what I want to do. And Jan paid a price. August 1996, he was driving this Mazda following his latest girlfriend home in her car. He slammed into her, then into a light post, drunk again. Just bad call. I'd been going through a divorce. We just came to a yellow stop signal. Yeah. I never stop a yellow stop signal. <laughs> the accident here on Alicia Parkway in Mission Viejo, California, left Jan in the hospital with a broken neck. He was lucky to be alive. Did that accident stop you from drinking once and for all? Pretty much. That was it. After all this, what do you think your reputation is in Hollywood now? <laughs> Snake bit, gut shot, broke leg, and dragging nine sucking puppies uphill. <laughs> I take it that's not good. Just give me a bottle of Naquil. His voice scratchy, damage to his vocal cords from treatment for the car accident, Jan sings the blues, but he's also looking to the future. He already has a small part in his old friend Don Johnson's TV show, Nash Bridges, to air next week. I don't think people have written me off. Not like I did anything really bad to them. I mean, I just did it to myself. <laughs> Jan told Phil that he attends weekly counseling sessions to help him remain sober. Extra will be right back. <laughs>